Welcome back to the second battle of Shilovo. So we already positioned our men. We're about to attack the Russian lines. We're actually at the outskirts of the main city. But we're not going to try to push too far. There's a lot of Russians there. So hopefully we can achieve a victory. And let's get this started. I have all my men positioned in the forest. And we're going to try to engage the enemy within the forest. Hopefully they won't catch us early on. All right, the calm before the storm. So let's start moving our men right at the outskirt of this town. Play tech position. Also, have quite a number of soldiers here. I'm also gonna be a little bit greedy and attack the crossroads. It's quite open field though. I'm kind of worried that the enemy has some machine guns positioned. But if we could take the crossroads, that will be an excellent bonus to our objective, actually. Let's go send the entire company at that direction. Alright, so all the orders have been set. I'm just going to wait for our men to engage the enemy. I'm going to fast forward a little bit and I'll see you guys soon. Alright guys, actually the enemy just have engaged us in the forest. I'm trying to see where they are. There they are. I wasn't expecting them to be positioned in the forest so we're going to have to try to take them out. We're going to lose quite a number of soldiers here. We lost three men in this company. A platoon. Not sure which one. Anyway. Quite dug in. Let us um, actually be have a gauge the enemy too. To start uh, attacking them. Got another trench line. here and see how uh, the battle's going. So far it doesn't look good. Oh, that was a really nice ambush on the Soviet side actually. Only uh, had more men nearby. Some of my reinforcements. We're slowly taking over the trench. We're taking a lot of men though. We're gonna try to push a little harder. If only we had some air support or some artillery. And we also found another Russian trench line. As you guys can see, this is a really nice position. If we could break through this defense, it really shows the power of our German soldiers. Let's keep pressing the attack. Looks like a commander has been killed guys. Um, a very bad loss. And there he is. Brave man for leading the, the soldiers in the front line. Also captures the prisoners. Very nice. There it is. This is the prisoner, and they killed the prisoner. We were able to take over the first trench line in the forest. The casualty rates is immense. This entire squad. Platoon is completely decimated. That's really bad. Gonna have no fight to the death though. As you guys can see, the second battle with Shilovo is not looking good. 
definitely needed some armor support or something. I might sue for peace in this fight, but I really want to take the crossroads and hopefully Malachite 1 could be another objective we could take. That. Take artillery fire. How do they know we're here? It's like we have a spy, guys. Attacking. How much we can do? Taking heavy fire. Really need to get right into the lines and take over those trenches. Our attack here has completely ceased. There's a couple stragglers. Artillery barrage is quite effective, actually. The phosphorus, oh, man. Soldiers really heavily hurt. He's fine for now. Well, panicking the front line. Since the crossroads seems to be kind of clear, we're gonna actually tell our men to run there. Try to steal the objective. Like we found a Russian trench line right here defending the outskirts of North Shilovo. It's really important to note that I really don't want North Shilovo yet. Choskino is my main objective. If I could take the crossroad alongside of that, it will be Gucci. Absolutely hate saying that. Anyway, keep attacking. I'm gonna have my men actually run across the battlefield and engage the enemy. Not sure this is a good call, but I think this could work. I have a tire platoon and give the assault covering fire, and hopefully, you could get close enough to cease those guns. Because, as you guys can see, the Russians do have some mortar, mortar teams firing upon us, and it's quite deadly, and also this gun. Very good. North Crossroads. The crossroads has been taken. We're gonna move on to Malachite 1. Can't give our men any time to rest. We need to keep pushing. Russians are holding really well in this position, because a lot of them. This trench line alone has a good two squads in it. A lot of heavy guns. Oh man. It's a valley of death for our side. This assault was a disaster. All the gray dots indicates my dead. Really good soldiers. They'll be re replaced and hopefully reinforced with several other companies. We need to really take Shilovo and push the Russians out. So our men are right up on their trenches. Very nice. Well placed grenade. You hear them suffer.
Unfortunately guys, I don't think we'll be able to take Chaskino in this battle. The Russians really did give us a good kicking. We have one survivor. That's actually falling back. We're able to take over this trench. Let's see if we can skirmish with the enemy at North Shilovo. I mean, let's just go into a mop up here. The Russians really did fight to the last man in this position. Gotta hand it down to their bravery. Defending the motherland is no joke. Let's go let's watch our men finish that. Uh, probably gonna send a second attack on Cheskin now. Gonna have them do a run formation. Like, this platoon. It's actually having a better time. Pick Malachite 1, that's really nice. Perhaps we could actually do a sneak attack on North Shilovo. Them to march. Give them some time to rest. That took a really long time to fish them off there. I think I'm gonna decide not to attack anymore. I'm gonna have them hold this position and just stay down. Like we actually see an enemy mortar team. Not good. Men are in the open. It's very not good. Let's okay, okay, okay. Let's go. Get them out of that open position. We're gonna be completely decimated by that mortar strike. Well guys, get out of there. Los, los! Gonna have this small little platoon probably do a left flank attack on Shuskino. Quite a number of order teams in Shilovo. Also, oh wow, there's a trench line all over the city. I'm definitely not gonna attack that yet. We need some armored. Cars or probably some Panzers. Nice, so yeah, our sneak attack is slowly moving forward. That formation. downing myself here. I'm not sure it is the, the best call. We're gonna, we might actually lose a lot of men. Let's see, at, at this angle, can their infantry squad see that attack? Does it seem like it? If I send this platoon to attack the enemy from the rear, I'm hoping the enemy doesn't react, react to it as fast. And they're still hammering my men. All of our guys here are just pinned down. Getting sprayed by shrapnel. Okay, very good. So I may have arrived here, so I'm gonna put them in formation. Try to get them into a nice line formation, and we're gonna try to commence the attack. It would be really nice if we could take those guns out. Let's put them on hunt. 
try to be really aggressive and just go in. We lost a man to a machine gunner. This could not be a good idea. I see there's a trench line really close by. Gotta tell these guys to come take that. Slow down the attack slightly. Alright guys, that was probably not the best call then. Looks like Shlovo is protected from the front and the back side. And he's really putting amazing defense. Kill the mortar team, it's really nice. If you actually could kill these guns, perhaps this battle was worth it. Casualties for now, we're gonna fall them back. Heavy guns are hitting us. Losing our squad just like that. Have these men fall back? Yeah, that's super peace. Hopefully, the Russians will take this. And they have not. So we had two attacks that did not work. Gotta keep attacking. The Russians do not want to have some peace here. Try to have these men fall back, but they're gonna have to fight to the death. Final assault. Let's see what they have. A couple of trench lines? Several trench lines, actually. Tires. Lines, this is a trench. Guys, just really concentrating on the battle. A little slightly bad for losing so much men, actually. But it is a campaign, and that's what I like about them. They're very unpredictable. Every time you play it, different outcomes. It only means when we come back for the second assault, I'm definitely going to use the Ponzos. Hunt. Really get on top of the, the enemy. Very 
bigger guys. Seems like the enemy has taken the ceasefire or we got lost too many. We'll find out soon. Battle has been a draw. As you guys can see, we have lost so much. Nearly 194 casualties, and with USSR has lost 261. Not the best results for the second day or second battle, Shilovo, but we must redeem ourselves next battle. Hope you guys enjoyed this one, and I'll see you guys next time.